Yo, what's good YouTube? It's Christian and I'm back with another reaction video. And you guys know why we're here. You guys know everything that happened yesterday. Snix or 69, he released a music video kind of out of nowhere and it's already at 48 million views or something like that. That's like a world record. This dude beats M beat Eminem's views in 24 hours. I think Eminem had like 33 million or something. This dude 69 has 40 something million. And when he went on live yesterday, he had 2 million people watching and the current record for that was like Tory Lanez and Drake with like 300,000. That's crazy. That's like, this dude's breaking numbers. Obviously it's because people wanted to see what he was going to be on because how he was before, like how he was such a troll and all that. And he's obviously still trolling, um, continuing with the whole snitch thing. Like he's going to keep using that forever because that's what's going to get him views. You feel me? If I, if this video gets 300 likes, I'll have my mom react to it as soon as I can. She's not here right now. So that's why. I'm doing it by myself and I've never really been even been a fan of 6 ix music it's just I feel like it's having this many views because people that don't like him want to see what he's on and people that are his fans are still just trying to check it out he has like this new shark thing too is that And the first thing he has, a whole bunch of girls with a gang of ass. That's all he has. A gang of girls, a gang of ass. And he still has that rainbow hair. It's like, doesn't even like make any sense. The things he's saying. It just doesn't make sense. I feel like my mom would laugh at this. My mom would laugh at this. So if you guys want my mom to react to it, just give me 300 likes and we'll do it as soon as possible. She hasn't seen 6 9 in a while. And that was the first reaction video we made on this channel with each other was a 6 9 reaction video. And that was like the start of it all. That's crazy. <laughs> And he was saying, he was saying in his videos how like no one can mess with him. He's the king in New York because they're not in his like tax bracket basically. Like once you get that watch he has, that Richard Milley, then then you could beef with him. And right here he said they chase clout and he is clout. This dude has a lot of clout. You saw that yesterday and with this video how much clout he has. Like I don't think people realize that 2 million people on one Instagram live is a lot of people. That's like more than two states combined. So more than two states combined was watching this guy, this guy's live. That's insane. Are you this dude trying to switch up the flow. <laughs> he said, are you dumb, stupid, are you dumb? Ha. This song literally makes like no sense. Way before coronavirus, he just had to throw that in there. I feel like he doesn't, I feel like no one cares what he's saying in the song. It's literally, they just wanted to come see him and see his video. They don't really care about the song because I feel like he didn't really have that many fans for his music. A lot of his fans were for his trolling and for his internet stuff because I know his internet stuff was pretty funny not even gonna cap like that's why i followed him because i wanted to see what he was gonna post on instagram and who he was gonna troll next that's just like what he does that's his baby mama too with the whole six nine tatted on him she got six nine's face tatted on him dude or on her that's bad you know how ugly this dude is and she got his or his face tatted on her that's like worse than him having all that those six nines on him There's a lot of people that are mad that he's back. Like I see that he's already beefing with Mick, Mick, Meek Mill. Like Meek Mill is falling into his trap. He should he should know 
Meek Mill should know what 6 9 is trying to do. You feel me? Like, 6 9 is trying to troll someone. He's trying to get more clout. He's trying to come back because he was gone for a cool minute. And Meek Mill, I, I mean, it would be cool for Meek Mill too with the whole clout thing, but it's just a lot of rappers, they're not gonna like mess with 6ix9ine just because they know what he's gonna try to do. They know what he's about. So it's just, come on, Meek Mill. <laughs> <laughs> he got that umbrella stuck in his hair. Tell me how a rat. Tell me how I rat and I came home to a big bag. A whole bunch of ass in there though. Not even gonna cap. Follow me on six. Oh my god. That's crazy. This dude really came back and got a bag. I heard he made like 20 million in jail or something like that or when he was locked up. And that's a lot of money for being made when you're locked up. And he keeps he keeps flexing everywhere that he came back after he snitched and he or after he snitched and he still like has a lot of money. Is that something to like flex about? I don't know. But he is back. You can't do nothing about that. You could be mad if he's back or not, but it's not going to change the fact that he is back. So you just gotta deal with him being here. You just gotta deal with him being here and see what he does next. I know that everything he does next is gonna hit. He like moves strategically. So he knows what he's doing. He knew he knew that he was gonna pop on the Instagram live video. And he knew that this music video was gonna do numbers. That's why he put it out so soon. He probably just he probably had someone write that for him real quick or he wrote it himself quick as hell. And did have no meaning behind it. He just wanted to put it out. Found a hard beat. Got some girls shaking ass in there. Did that whole 6-9 color scheme. And just put that. I wonder I wonder if that was in his house. Because he's on house arrest. And I don't know that whole situation. If he could like leave or anything like that. But if he has that whole thing inside of his house. That kind of looks hard. Not going to lie. It matches his whole persona. His whole bright colors and all that. Um, Like I said. 300 likes. And I'll have my mom react to it. She's going to come back soon. So yeah. So comment down below if you like this video, subscribe if you're new, like this video if you enjoy it. Sorry, girl, I got a ghost. Uh, yeah, you know this ain't the old me.